the name of Jesus Christ. I am very glad to share this thought with all of you from Las Vegas. Today we have started our uh, Standing in the Gap prayer. Uh, we are planning to have three days fasting and prayer and to stand in the gap and pray for USA. Okay, today's thought is from Psalm 31, verse 15. My times are in your hand. Deliver me from the hand of my enemies and from those who persecute me. This is a prayer of David. David prayed, Lord, deliver me from my enemies and deliver me from the people those are persecuting me. Then he said, my times are in your hand. He had a confidence that my times are in God's hand. So, very confidently he prayed to the Lord, Lord deliver me because I know my times are in your hand. Because God had the times of David in his hand, at the right time the Lord delivered David from all his enemies. Bible says the time came in his life and God gave him complete rest. The Lord removed every enemies from his life. The same thing God wants to do it to you also. You can also boldly say, Lord, my times are in your hands. And also you can say, deliver me from my enemies. God will deliver you from all your enemies because your future is in his hand. Your times are in his hand. Shall we do a word of prayer? Lord, thank you for holding our times. Lord, many times we are discouraged because it's getting delayed. But Lord, this morning we believe that our times are in your hand, O oh God. Lord Jesus, bless your children, Lord. Bless them abundantly, Lord. Set them free from their enemies, O oh God. Lord, thank you, Lord. Very soon do a miracle in their life, O oh God. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. God will do miracles in your life. Have a blessed day. Amen.